Hello again, everybody. I'm Warren Smith, and here's what we're bringing you in the current issue of World Magazine. Today's news, Christian views, World Magazine. Our cover story is on a young Texas politician whose popularity is breathing new life into the Republican Party and its prospects for attracting Hispanic voters. Our Washington bureau chief, Lee Pitts, ventured outside the Beltway, well outside, all the way to Houston, Texas, to profile Ted Cruz, a candidate for the U.S. Senate, and to show us what Cruz's candidacy says about the GOP's chances for winning the Hispanic vote. And Jamie Dean continues our election coverage from North Carolina. North Carolina is a swing state and one President Obama recently visited both to drum up votes for himself and to push for the defeat of Amendment 1, a constitutional amendment to protect marriage. Also in this issue, our editor-in-chief Marvin Olasky has a conversation with former football star and former congressman J.C. Watts. Now one of the key lessons Watts says he's learned over the years is to let principles and not the cheers of the crowd determine your behavior. Marvin also takes us on a tour of the Antietam Civil War battlefield, the site of what even today is still the bloodiest day in American military history. This tour and Marvin's thoughts about that battle are both sobering and inspiring and provide an excellent backdrop for reflection on the upcoming Memorial Day weekend. Veteran reporter Jill Nelson takes us to Israel where she has an in-depth article on that country's preparations for war should that dreaded but very real possibility ever come to pass. And for something a little off the beaten path, Emily Bells takes us to Cock County, Tennessee to examine the tradition of cockfighting and what some evangelical leaders, leaders who don't normally get involved in this issue, are doing to bring that cruel practice to an end. Now, before I go, I want to give you an update on a couple of new features on our website. I started writing a column there called Signs and Wonders. Signs and Wonders is a collection of short, what I hope will sometimes be humorous, and often ironic accounts of events in the day's news. Mindy Bells, our editor, is responsible for a new feature she calls Globetrot. Globetrot offers an international perspective. You might consider it your global news briefing with headlines, Mindy's pithy insights, and links to background material that will allow you to dig more deeply into the story. Both Globetrot and Signs and Wonders appear every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at worldmag.com. And Globetrot is also available via email. If you'd like to have it delivered to your inbox, just email Mindy at mbells at worldmag.com. Well, thanks for joining me once again for this little video preview of the current issue of World. I hope you enjoy the issue, and I look forward to being with you again next time. World. Today's news, Christian Views.